Hello, I'm Zach. Today I'll be sharing with you a burrito recipe. I will be making two variations. So a seafood octopus one and also a chicken one. So let's get to it. Now to introduce you the ingredients, we have fresh romaine lettuce, um, some tomatoes and chili as well to spice things up and give it more color as well. Um, we have the wrap, wrapped for the burrito and some edamame beans to add some protein as well. Rice of course and then cheese to shave some cheese topping over it. Uh, lime as well to mix a little bit of zest with the belacan that we are going to be doing. Um, for the protein, we'll be using, for the seafood one, we'll be using some mini octopus. Right, uh, this will be mari not marinated but uh, cooked with the spicy one later on, right, with the spicy sauce. And then for the chicken, it has already been pre marinated with the original sauce. Alright, we'll be starting with making the rice first. So, right here, we have some jasmine rice. Uh, you can use Japanese short grain rice as well. I think it will work a lot better with the burrito. I didn't have that, so I will just be using jasmine rice. We will also be adding some of the ingredients in towards the end of like cooking the rice. So, the edamame, we will add some of my original sauce in as well to flavor the mixed rice uh, and also the octopus. So, the octopus can't be cooked too long, which is why we are putting it at the end. Alright. Let's start. So wash the rice first. Wash the rice. At least twice. Better three times. Uh, I don't have the cup here as well, so I'm using the finger. So just gonna let it cook. So medium. About medium high heat for 13 to 15 minutes. Because this is my first time cooking it with the Japanese clay pot. Let's see, how, let's see how well it will become. While the rice is cooking, we can start with preparing the vegetables first. So um, I have some washed romaine lettuce here ready. We're gonna cut that up to smaller pieces and also remove away the not so nice bits of the lettuce. Okay, we are going to chop them up to smaller pieces. Right. Just group them together. And we will also be seasoning them together with the uh, tomatoes as well. Slice them up into strips. Get some tomatoes. We're going to dice them and dice them up. Right. So let me wash them first. Cut it in half. Remove the top. And then just dice them into cubes, small little cubes. We have them mix the tomato together with the lettuce. We we'll do a little bit of chili in as well, diced up. Cut off the head. Then, if you want to remove the seed, just roll it out. I should really be doing this in the sink. Once most of that is out, so we won't be using too much. Yeah, just half a stick. And then I'll just do a basic. Um, balsamic vinaigrette dressing. Don't need too much because we'll be the sauce will be the main power. Just a little bit of olive oil and balsamic. Oops, that's a lot. Mix it up. If you don't have balsamic at home you can also just use slime or the calamansi. Now the salad is done, put it in the fridge we are ready to make the burrito. We'll be cooking the chicken next, right? Uh, in the oven, of course I don't want to make a mess by frying. Right, so this chicken was marinated yesterday night. So we scrape off the sauce, off the skin. 
so that the skin can be crispy afterwards. I also got my blowtorch, so I can torch up the skin later to give that char taste. The side so that it doesn't dry it up. Okay, I'm going to be folding up a little bit so that it doesn't leak out the side. So put it in the oven. Heat 180 for about 20, 20 minutes. The rice is ready, so we're gonna be adding the other ingredients. Ooh. God, looks so good. Looks so nice. Got a hole here and there also. I'm gonna fluff up the rice. Oh, there's a little bit of crispy bit at the side. Okay, we'll be adding the edamame in. And there is a lot of edamame. So, and also the octopus in as well. They look a lot now, but they shrink up a lot too. This will bring some sweetness into the rice as well. Let's shake the marinade. Let's put like one, two, three, three spoons. If not enough, can always add more later. Stir them up a little bit and then cook for another, I would say two, three minutes. Okay. Put it back to cook for another two, three minutes. Okay, so for dipping sauce in a way, we will be using, I'll be using balachan with some lime. Uh, you can add a little bit of sugar if you want some sweetness to it. I'm just improvising on the spot and making it the Asian way. So this can be our little spicy dipping sauce afterwards. are all small now. Okay, the purpose too sweet. A lot of water came out, it's a little bit wet. So you'll be having a little bit wet burrito. Oh, but the side not crispy. some tita tortilla wrap putting them together some salad dressing that we made together with some octopus rice they just rice for now 
octopus. And I guess we are mixing in the chicken. Okay, it's going to be a little bit too fat, too full. We have some leftover half cheese that we can shake. Then just wrap it up so it's a little bit crispy. Okay, it's not very packed, but <laughs> it will work. That's it. And a little bit of blachan. And we're done! Let's try eating it. Okay, this one has a lot of balachan, so it's gonna be spicy. My goodness. It's still off too. My food is here. Oh my god, spicy. This has no cheese, but it sure tastes good as well. Okay, the chicken is quite... The chicken's flavour is so flavourful there. It's covering the rice, but it's nice getting some chewiness from the octopus as well. Oh, my, it's good. But very nice mm, crunchiness that comes from the lettuce as well. Don't need too much flavor from it. Run five with the chili. The chili, the chili is painful. That's why I didn't want to like put it in the red itself, like mm. so that you can control it. But oh, the chili, <laughs> chili kicks in, man. The blachan. Mm. What about the nice standard chicken, QQ octopus and crunchy lettuce, right? Quite nice. Thanks for watching the video. Oh my goodness, the chili. <laughs> if you like this video, you can subscribe down below uh, for more future videos. See ya. Bye bye. Hello. Hi, I'm Zach. Today uh, I'll be making some burrito. It won't be authentic, it'll just be just something 